Hello and welcome back to Fable Anniversary, the final episode. You're gonna grab the two lost souls that this device requires, and then we are gonna deal with Jacko Blades one final time. Okay, uh, where's the map? Uh, minimap. Ah, there we go. It's been, it's, it's actually been a long time since I played the game right now. I could kill her if I want to power this, but I'm not. I'm gonna pay my respects as at uh, our hero's mother's grave and use her soul instead. I figured that the dead can be used one way or another, that the, the, the living cannot, and vice versa, and I'm gonna use the living to support me if they can. Uh, what's the name of uh, our home? Oakvale. And I have a feeling that it won't just be as easy as taking a stroll through the graveyard and collect a soul. No. It's gonna be fighting here. Hasn't she suffered enough? Would you really do that to your own mother? Take Briar. She is of no use to anyone. Sorry, uh... I have totally forgotten how to put my weapon away. I need to check it out. Um, how do I put my weapon away? Is that LT? L LB? Put it away. Sorry. Good. Oh. Whew. I didn't mean to walk in here armed. No. I think I'll go and cash, uh, pick up some money while we're here. Pick up the rent. A hero's gotta feed himself somehow. And I do own the place after all. Let's see. Sell? No. Do you want to live? No, I don't want to live there. Too many bad memories. Okay, let's make our way up to the graveyard. Collect our mother's soul in... Um, Jack's mask and head back to the device. And after that, we will figure out what the third, well, Potterhead, will have figured out. Something tells me there's going to be a lot of screaming. <laughs> the Potterhead will have figured out what's uh, needed to be done. Haven't I activated? Oh, it is on. I guess it doesn't show whenever Jack speaks. Good day, hero. If you need someone to fight evil by your side, I'm your man. Sure. Excellent. There is true honor in work. When you're done with my services, Jack, it's an honor to fight beside such a fearless hero. Come on. You're gonna help me in Memorial Garden. Yeah. Oh no, not those. I really dislike them. I know what you seek, son. But Jack has sent a legion of screamers to torment my soul. They won't allow me to leave. And now they will try to take you too. I guess I'll just have to shut them up. Permanently. We'll do no good standing here. Oh no you don't. I'm ready. Good. Now deal some damage. Or you won't pay it at all. Let's move. Okay, there's a lot of them. This shouldn't be too hard. No, I think this is actually a little bit easier than the arena. Come on. Just gonna spam them the magic. Good. Oh, there's a. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of them. I have a feeling I should really be going range on these things, but I I'm not good playing as a range hero in this game. It doesn't work for me. Die. 
More of you. You just keep spawning in, don't you? I guess this is what it sounds like on a Bieber concert. Yeah. <laughs> oh, if this, if uh, if this game had been created after. Oops. Oh shit! I am actually thinking after Bieber's first concert. If this is what it all sounds like. Uh, it is sounding like that. Jesus. Die, oh gee. I'm eating like a maniac right now. Huh. That was tough. Jack's spirit is strong, and his new form is almost ready. But I sense how he fears you. Take my soul and avenge our family once and for all. And make him pay, son. I will make him pay once more, mother. We think we've deciphered the third inscription. Come back to the you shrine and I'll show you. have taken the right path in life. That's for sure. How do I... Yeah. Very well. May we meet again. I think he did uh, a good job helping me. I'm I'm not sure. I I I was actually focusing on staying alive, eating all those hams you can see in the down left corner of the screen. Yeah, that was my focus. Okay. I'm just gonna go visit. Oh, that's the wrong way. I'm gonna visit the shop and uh, buy myself some. Main Supplies, and then I'll see you up again once I get back to the shrine in a moment's time. Sure. That's the third soul. I'm sure your mother would be proud. Now, there's just one inscription left. The oldest soul. But we still haven't figured out who that might mean. Oh, come. We both know who it is, dear Briar. You can't protect the old fool any longer. It's the Guildmaster the Shrine wants, hero. Jack? So it really is true. He's alive. And still up to his old mind games. I hope the Guild Acolytes can come up with a better idea. You should go back to the guild and speak with them. Yeah. And she's off again. Fine, let's head on over to the guild. And uh, hopefully we'll get to know what to do. I don't think we have to kill the guild master. No. I actually think I know who it is. Yes. Hmm, I think it's the undead guy that we gave the armor to. Oh, welcome back, sir. This place has been a mess since you left. People running around with bits of old paper, books flying everywhere. And a guild master's only gone and holed himself up in the guild woods. We're not supposed to let anyone near him. We found it. The soul mentioned in the inscription. It must be Nostro. His soul has been trapped in the Litchfield graveyard for centuries. Our texts suggest it should be in the graveyard circle, you know, where you found the tunnel to Bargate Prison. Catching souls? Never heard such nonsense. Well, good luck, hero. Uh, thank you. Do I have enough experience points to level up? I have more than enough, I think. Toughness, uh, let's see. That's all strength. Speed, accuracy, level one. Wow. Guile, learn to, yeah. You know what? Let's go for accuracy. Yeah. Level 
Level 4. Level 6. Yeah, that's it. I still have a little bit of strength. Let's upgrade toughness. Yeah, that's all I get. Fine. Okay. Let's... Yeah, we're not going up there to kill him. No. Now, where did he say the, the graveyard? Litterfield graveyard. Circle of the dead. Am I able to teleport up there? Doesn't look like that. Okay. Litterfield graveyard it is then. Uh. So we need to head north to Old Graveyard Path. Okay. Ah. This looks like it's the right way to go. Hello, guys. Oh, the guild told us you'd come. Here, I don't know what's going on, but it's like the end of the world in there. It is, actually. But hey, <laughs> now that you're here, we can get the whole thing sorted, right? <laughs> I didn't join the 5th Regiment so I could stand around guarding graves all day? Oh no, sir! You need to take the orders you are given. Otherwise you'll be fired. And maybe even executed. Yeah, I'm just gonna ignore these guys. I don't see a reason in fighting these. No. Ouch. That's really unnecessary. Please move away from me. Hi. You just keep fighting each other. <sighs> oh shit, spellcasters. Spellcasters! Big guys! It's special spellcasters! Okay, we made it through. Whew. I think we're at the circle of the dead now. It uh, looks like it, yes. Guildsmen, we meet once more. You reclaimed my weapons and armor and brought me peace. Now, I offer my soul in return. But I am Nostro, and mine is a warrior's soul. You must take it in battle so that I may stand proud among my comrades in the afterlife. My men have sworn an oath to protect me even in death. Only when they fall can I be harmed. Now, claim my soul with honor. Chewy! It sounded like Chewbacca. <laughs> Collect Nostra's soul from the literal graveyard site. Okay, let's just try and shoot them a little bit. Can I hit it? Yeah. One more. Yeah, that won't work. Whoa, okay, he just... Well, threw me on, on my face, on the ground. Ouch. We don't. Ouch. It's really annoying that they can uh, uh, throw me on the ground like that. Really annoying. Look at that! They're undead for bloody sake. Take them out one by one. Ouch. He, yeah. That I can accept, that you, you tossed me on the ground like that. But not the small ones, no, they are not that strong. Oh, for... okay. I thought I had to kill all of them.
What I had to kill all of them for him to turn mortal. Ouch. Oh. Wait, what's the one behind him? I didn't see him. Oh, fuck. That dog that awesome. Ouch. Come on, stop hitting me. He's almost dead. There we go. the time okay I'm gonna run back to uh, the shrine and I'll see you there in a moment's time guys Inscriptions say only one hero will be allowed to pass through the gate, and, hey, guess what? You're the strongest. I don't know what form Jack's going to take, but I don't think it's going to be small and furry, do you? <laughs> Good luck. For all our sakes. You're too late, little hero. Once more, too late. Come to the Bronze Gate. We have unfinished business. Go now. You cannot escape your fate any longer. I know. I'm sure you can do it. I've never fought beside a hero like you before. There's nothing you can't do. Thank you for saying that. You didn't have much faith in me when I first joined the guild. No. What is this? One last treasure? Uh... Demon Warrior Helm. 200 years ago, a war broke out between the temples of Avo and Skorm. The Demon Warriors flew the banner of their evil deity and terrorized all that came in their way with their infernal, beastly visage. Not a Demon Warrior Helm, but a Demon Warrior. I gotta equip that. Uh, what button is it? There we go. Equipment. Yeah, it actually wears the rest. It, it wears, it fits the rest of my gear as well. Yeah. Okay. Let's go say hello to Jack of Blades once more. The Bronze Gate, though the gate has remained closed throughout the modern age and there are no records chronicling its purpose, scholars have speculated that Archon himself may have locked away a great evil behind it. According to some Snowspire myths, the opening of the gate will bring about the end of the world. Locals say it is no accident that its metal feels hot to the touch. Hot to the touch, eh? Well, there is lava around it, so that could be the reason, but I don't think it is. <coughs> a long time ago, well before the age of the Old Kingdom, the skies of Albion were full of fearsome, majestic dragons. They flew wherever they wished, ate the people's livestock, rained down fire on their villages, and distressed their damsels. Then came the Kingdom of Archon. And with it, heroes who hunted the dragons for sport, almost driving them to extinction. 
Before long, every home in Albion had dragon scale curtains, dragon claw back scratchers, and dragon foot paperweights. The few remaining dragons fled to the northern wastes, and there they remain to this day. Though they are nowhere near as powerful now as they once were, they still represent a hero's ultimate test. It's a dragon. Awesome. You changed a little bit. Did you gain weight, Jack? I think you gained weight after I killed you last time. Okay. Uh, I have no idea how this fight will go. Oh, fuck me. Let's just shoot him in the face. Oh fuck, that was not smart. How am I supposed to avoid that? Just run, I guess? He has a lot of health! This fight gonna take a while if I keep doing this. Where did he go? No, I actually don't. Well, I have... I have a, a, a clue, actually, of how small I look to you. After all, I'm just a human being and you are a ginormous dragon! Which looks awesome! Don't say that. Shoot in the face. Ooh, let's get away from that. Okay. Can't I get away from that? Doesn't look like it. He is thinking highly of himself, isn't he? Okay. That's not nice. I think I'll just use the sword. Yeah, that's actually a lot better. Look at his health going down, as well as mine. Whoo! That dealt a lot of damage to that guy. I say guy, he's not a guy anymore. Oh! Fuck, what's that? Ah! It's a dragon! Can I heal up a little bit more? Summoners, I hate them. What the hell? I changed spell! Oh! I forgot how, how I changed spell! Okay, there you go. Not good. I lost focus for a moment. Oh fuck. Now I need to eat pie to stay alive.
Okay, let's finish him off. Not the dirty way, though. Now you're gonna kill him. There we go. One more. Final battle. Press completed. It was a battle that will be talked about for centuries to come. The day the hero of Oak Vale slew the dragon, Jack of Blades. The day the strange creature behind the mask was finally banished from this world. And this is where our tale must end. Though even the most hopeful of hearts knew the struggle between good and evil would never be truly over. As for what became of the guild and its heroes, that is a story for another time. <sighs> We're done with Fable Anniversary. But before I end this game, I want to visit a place. It's a surprise, so I'll see you there in a moment's time. I Have think it's time our hero had some R&R. &R. Yes, now where is she? There she is. You are not broken like other men. This is good. Hedwig can play with you again. Yes. Rough it up with Mr. Hedwig. This way, puny worm. Jesus. <laughs> you no stop until Hedvig say stop. On knees, now, me want to see you beg. You call yourself men? This not good enough! Hedvig pleased this puny man. <laughs> this is good thing. Okay. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this uh, playthrough of Fable Anniversary. I know it has taken a long time. I started playing this game, I think, uh, October last year, and it is finally done. I like the tattoo, though. Smiling ladies, yeah. So once again, thank you for watching this series. I hope you enjoyed it. Until until next time. Goodbye.